Well, what do you like on TV? Hmm. I like dramas. Dramas? I like comedies. 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 Who's your favorite comedian? Oh, man. Um, Mike Myers. Mike Myers, huh? <laughs> he, want, he likes to shag, doesn't he? He likes to, <laughs> he likes to shag. Well, who's your favorite uh, drama actor? I like Felicity, the show Felicity, but I like them all. Felicity, isn't that the one that... What, what's Felicity? It's on the WB. Like, WB, that's that's some cheap TV yeah, right no. there. <laughs> it's cheap and good. <laughs> it's escapism, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice. Well, what, what do you like to do in Boulder to escape? Um, come to the Creek Fest. Yeah. Yeah. It brings outside. Boulder together. It's just like, you think so? it's great. I love it. I love Pearl Street, I love too. being outside, Big on Pearl Street. Street. walking around. Right. Do, you all, do you all live within, like, close proximity of the yeah. city? Well, she lives up in the mountains. Yeah, I live in the mountains. Yeah. But right basically, it's pretty close. Well, are you all in high school or what? Yeah. What, what grades? Juniors. All juniors, huh? Boulder High School or? Yep. Oh, yeah. The best. Best school. Yeah. Oh yeah, I, what's up with Fairview though? They seem to be kicking. What is up with them? I would like Boulder's Boulder High School. Fairview's just the next to high school. Yeah, but what's happened? Right? Suddenly Fairview's kicking Boulder's ass. What's up with no. that? No, no, we beat them in football. Thank you. We beat them in volleyball. volleyball. We beat them in basketball. Volleyball. We beat them in soccer. We beat them in state. Who, who's the smarter high school? They have more people than they do. So if they score higher, so they have 100 more people than we do. First of all, second of all, about half. A lot of people who go to Fairview are supposed to be going to Boulder. Well, they, I, I've been told that Boulder High School is kind of snobbish compared to Fairview. No, 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 it's all, all the way around. around. Oh, yeah. All the way around. Oh, they are like the snottiest so kids. You're left. more down to earth. Then. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. I like talking about Fairview. What, what, yeah. what, oh, uh, <laughs> what do you think about the kissing incident? You know, the whole thing, they made such yeah. a big they deal. Made, they we made too big of a deal of it. Was it embarrassing? Was it a good idea? I mean... They just made too big of a deal yeah. out of something, and then the TV shows and like radios completely misbroadcast it. Made it seem like a different. Well, shouldn't thing. they just have printed that picture in the yearbook? I mean, I understand the controversy. Yeah, they're trying really, to protect the girls. I don't really have an opinion on the whole printing the picture thing. Yeah, yeah they were trying to protect them, but I mean, uh, you know, it's kind of. Like they didn't know. They didn't get anything dealt with. They didn't ask any parents. They didn't. Yeah, they didn't. Yeah. Follow they they up went straight anything. to the press on that. Exactly. Yeah. And they, so they kind of was made into a huge deal. Do you think there's some some uh, prejudice and? It, at Boulder High as, as kids, I mean, it must be pretty tough when you... It's not too bad at Boulder. I it's mean, not that it's bad. We're getting better. I think, like, we just had an assembly where we talked about discrimination and prejudice, and, like, I think we're figuring a lot of it out and just putting it out in the open. We're, our school like to talk about things. Like, yeah. we don't try to keep things under wraps. Like, we, we definitely talk about stuff, which is really cool, we I think. We try to do a lot with, like, yeah. getting, getting everyone and, like, involved. Getting and, like, yeah, like, like the gay straight alliance is, like, the gay straight alliance. It's, like, bringing people together. It's not just the gay alliance, you know? It's, like bringing people together it's not segregating people so, so you know i mean basically and i mean homosexuality is that a, that seems to be a genetic natural thing or do you think it's something that people uh, choose to do i don't think it's genetic i think it's I a think choice choose, choose. oh do. you that's do huh that's that's on you i mean that's in this day and age you would think that you wouldn't think that but you actually yeah. think you yeah. choose to do that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, what about the ecstasy problem? Is that is that really a problem, or is that just kind of like blown out of proportion as well? I think. Have you tried ecstasy? I mean, you, this is all confidential. Uh, <laughs> access. <laughs> no, I haven't. No. And but even if I wouldn't ever, because of the whole what happened, because I wouldn't know what. How about that ecstasy panel? I mean, do you think that was a good idea? I thought it was too wet. You mean the like World Conference Fair? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I went to that. They, 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 they were just about. talking about like the actual drug and what it does to you. Yeah. And it wasn't what we wanted. There was no like true accounts of it or yeah. people's experiences. It was really boring. I fell asleep. So did I. Yeah, uh, they didn't te they didn't teach you how to like say. It could have been a really cool. Several times, and he was like, they don't know what the hell they're talking about. This yeah. isn't what it's like. This isn't what it does to you at all. They just they just talked like scientifically because they were all like scientists. Like it does this to your brain and this to your body. And it's like no one really cared about that. Yeah, I mean, it's a, you're a little too young to be thinking about consequences down the road, huh? Except for that, that girl that unfortunately drank too much water. <laughs> oh, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, that's okay. <laughs> that's all right. <laughs> well, I don't really know anything. Well, 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 let's get back to fun and games here. Okay. What do you What do you most like about this about this Memorial Day weekend and what's we going on here? Day off of school. No school, Free yeah. Weekend. We have one last week and we have four One last week. Uh, screw that. You won't be doing anything that yeah, week. I know. Nope. Definitely not.
And then you'll be seniors, then you'll be king of the hill. Yeah, right? we're gonna ruin all the little eights. I mean, I mean, help them transition into high school. You're gonna terrorize the eighth yeah, graders. Yeah, pretty right? much. So it's coming in freshmen. We have some plans. Do, do yeah. you find that, do, is there some bullying that goes on, especially like guys against other guys? Or? No, not anymore. They, they like out cameras. Because yeah. they like, are, uh, hey Kendall. <laughs> Um, they, after the, what happened to Columbine, they got really strict on school. Like, we used to hate freshmen a lot, like, freak them and, like, dress them up and do a bunch of stuff. But after, that was our freshman year, and after that year, they, they like, wouldn't allow anyone to do anything. Them. They never got hurt. No one was ever hurt. They yeah. just... But it was kind of it's psychological fun. terror. It's, yeah, so yeah. they... It was the freshman like it, though, the, the freshman year. The freshman year. I thought it was it. fun. Well, because it's usually, like, siblings. It's usually, like, you have an older brother yeah. or sister, and it's, like... And all those younger kids liked it because they friends. all met people that, because it was the very yeah. beginning of school and they all met people they didn't know and it was, I mean, they all had fun. It was really so? special that they were getting initiated. I had fun when I got hazed. I was like, yeah. it's fun. I got no one got hurt. Yeah, yeah, it's, not, it's not like violent, you know? So you, yeah, it's not malicious or anything. So no, there's no, no like, like uh, you know, because I remember, you know, in high school, I remember getting put in a trash can by the football players. And the football players are mean, but that's yeah. not, the girls are, I don't know. We're not like we're mean to them. Nicer. It just... I think it's part of high school to initiate the freshmen in. Yeah, we got initiated. Kind of fun. We should be able to initiate the freshmen coming in. And then they like well, they start to suspend if you do anything at all. Yeah. And now we have like cameras in our school, which is so lame. Yeah, what do you think about all that? I mean, do you think don't you have a right to privacy? It's nice for things like because they have it in parking lots. So if your car yeah. gets screwed up, you could go get things checked. Or like if Fairview wanted to come over, because they they used to do things where they'd write all over in like spray paint, like FHS all all over our school, and they can't do that anymore. And how about smoking? I mean, remember the, at one time you had a smoking section and then you could, now where do you smoke? Do you uh, off campus. campus. Off campus. Under Next the to the Boulder Creek. Creek. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm yeah. jogging by there and it's like, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> yeah. how do you feel about that? Wouldn't it be better if they just had a smoking section in the field or something? I don't know. I think, well, I mean, I don't, I don't think we should encourage it. If they're gonna, yeah. people are going to smoke, they're going to smoke. Actually, it's they illegal to smoke it. if you're under 18, right? Well, no, it's illegal to buy. Oh, you can. Have, that's kind of strange. You you can't, you can't buy, buy, but you can, you can smoke. smoke. <laughs> wow, that's weird. That's that seems like hypocrisy. <laughs> Look at that. It looks flirtation here. Oh man, we got How many of you have you already got boyfriends or, or what? Oh, they do. Yeah. They do. do you, how, how far? <laughs> is it just kissing at this point. I hope. Uh, <laughs> is that a hitch right there? On your neck? <laughs> Definitely, it's, it's, it's free. Yeah, so. okay. We'll definitely it's do that. It's a little crazy down there. Have you ever watched Jan Scott? No. That's good, because he's a fascist. He's a homophobe. Totally. You know, like the kissing at the Boulder High yeah. School? Yeah, it was so was, cool. Wasn't that cool? Yeah, yet, it was. I Jan mean, Scott actually had the balls to say that was like uh, promoting homosexuality. It wasn't. It, it was so, so we could, like, they didn't put the picture in the yearbook, so we, like, we yeah. had to kiss them so people would know it's okay. But yeah. not everybody there we're was gay, true, and that's you know? what they said. Exactly. Girls were just kissing girls for the, he for the heck of it. It wasn't like we were... Well, even if you were, it doesn't really matter. Right. It's just yeah. people having, uh, being cool. affectionate, right? Yeah. Why can't everybody be affectionate, right? Yeah. More affection. Yeah. But according to Jan Scott, I mean, I mean, nobody would kiss Jan Scott. Maybe a tarantula. So <laughs> 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 horrible. <laughs> he is horrible. So uh, what what else do you do in Boulder? Now, I mean, as a 14-year-old, what is there enough things to do to no keep way. you busy? Or? I hate living in Boulder. <laughs> Me too. It's so boring. Have you been able to stay away from drugs at, at an early age? You, yeah. The fear factor. Yeah. No drugs for me. No drugs. no drugs for me. Yeah, that's cool. What do you What do you think about that ecstasy thing that happened? Did, was that too bad? I mean. I think it was really sad because like it was her first time trying it and she like I mean one of them died and the other one I still think like she's still like extremely like affected for it and it's so dumb it was just once trying it and like could kill you and it's so not do, worth do it. you think that they should be punished any more than what no, happened no, no definitely not so this whole thing with the court system is kind of silly I mean there one girl is almost what going to prison though? didn't we know about this well you know they're, they're taking the, the girl other girls they went to court you know the other partiers and and then, uh, you know, the girl that actually gave the ecstasy is, oh, yeah. is plea bargaining, but <laughs> she almost well, went to jail. The girl that gave the ecstasy, I don't know, she was, like, dealing the drugs, I guess. 
Yeah, so I do think I don't really know punished. like the whole story and everything that's behind it. Right. So. We, we we only heard it in the newspaper. We were, we've been talking about it. Like a bunch of our friends talk about it, but it's never really been like this huge topic. You know. Did, did the teachers or the parents uh, they had meetings and stuff? Or? I don't know. We just had the conference on world affairs at Boulder High, and, and we did an ecstasy panel, and so that was I think that really helped like make people understand more about ecstasy and like what it does too so it really helped it's a it was a good panel it was about the best yeah it's funny because uh, again i hate to bring up jan scott and i know you don't know who he is but he actually said oh that promoted ecstasy as well he just yeah he yeah everything i mean he you think you're, that light. you're 14 and yet you seem to be more aware about uh, about issues than he is that's, that's how i see it i mean i mean he, people are going to take ecstasy some people Exactly. You know? They're going to do so it they whether their parents say no or not. So they, they, they should be aware of the effects and how to, exactly. you know, not to drink too much water. And, you know, I mean, I have to confess that I did ecstasy in the past. I don't do it anymore, <laughs> but luckily I didn't, you know, have a medical problem. But 